they are unhappy with their lot. Oh, why torment yourself, I ask? The ox cannot become a lion, and why would you want to? What wants all those responsibilities and worry? Do your job. Fire the man? Flying squad came and took him. You ain't gonna see him around no more. Samuel always thought that the pew on Sunday went to hell. In hand with the desk on Monday. Science is the slow revelation of God's blueprint. After two years in the Lamb's Tower on Monument Island, he took ill with cancer of the stomach. I prayed to the prophet, and the prophet delivered unto us a miracle through his servant, Fink. I do not know if I will ever get used to a husband bound in a skeleton of metal, but better a handyman than a dead one. trouble because I'm more than happy to be of service.
white man, 17 years old, charged with... You wanna know what we do to pretty little stowaways? Or maybe you don't. Hey! Stay away. Just stop for a minute! Stay away! Just want to talk to you. I said, stay away. <laughs> Elizabeth. Just hold up for a minute! I'm not angry with you! Get away from me! Stay away! Hey, watch out! Move it! Move! No, no, no! It's her! Call it in! Call it in! No! Let me go! There's gotta be another way in.
Just need to supply enough weapons to arm an entire uprising. And where will we get these weapons? From one of our many friends and allies? A gunsmith in Finkton should be a walk in the park. What do you say, partners? You're a liar, Mr. DeWitt. And a thug. But you're also my only means of reaching Paris. <laughs> Comfortable with my company, Mr. Finks a good man. The moment you do, you will see what those hyenas are made of. I ask you, where are they going to be when it's cold outside and your boys got the mumps and you've got nothing on your table but regret? D don't you see what the Vox Populi are selling? They're selling dreams! Dreams, my friends. Uh, they don't come cheap. Fitzroy. She's either a great hero or the worst of scoundrels, depending on who's doing the telling. She's good for an airship. I don't care if she's the Queen of Holland.
truth is, I don't have a lot of time for all that prophecy nonsense. I tell you, belief is, is just a commodity. And old Comstock, well, he does produce. But like any tradesman, he's obliged to barter his product for the earthly ores. You see, one does not raise Welcome a barn on salt. Welcome to Fink Industries Recruitment. Hmm, no we salt. are not looking for any help. Fink you hear that? No Fink help. How are we going to get into Finkton? Illegally. Let's look for another way in. Let's take a look at this. There we go. Over there, a service elevator. It should take us down to Finkton. And get ourselves killed in the bargain. If not a knife in the back of our profit! Rejoice! Or death has no speed! Nice! Smith Chen Lin wanted for known connections to the outlaw Daisy Fitzroy. Looks like our guy's drawn attention. That's not good, is it? Elizabeth, no. Hmm. Got it.
Booker. It's Slate's locker. He must have worked here. Uh, this is my mother's diary. Why would Slate have it? My husband claims the child was created from whole cloth by divine will. I am a believer, but I am not a fool. His bastard shall not be raised under this roof. My mother, she had me locked in that tower. Elizabeth. I just want to get out of this city. Please. Jeremiah Fink, and I want to share with you my personal creed. What is the most admirable creature on God's green earth? Why, it's the bee. Have you ever seen a bee on vacation? Have you ever seen a bee take a sick day? Well, my friends, the answer is no. So I say, be the bee. Be the bee. Maybe you should get that. Uh, hello? Mr. DeWitt? Uh, yes? Hold for Mr. Fink, please. What's going on? DeWitt, Fink here. Listen, my boy, we've had our eye on you, and I can tell you right now that you are our top candidate. Top! <laughs> now, uh, my associate, Mr. Flambeau, will help you with anything you need. <laughs> what the hell was that? I have no idea. He seems... Oddly pleased to make your acquaintance. Well, the man's got an ego. find a variety of supplies here that should see you through your visit. What does Mr. Fink want with us? Excuse me, miss, but Mr. Fink's interest is strictly in the gentleman. But why... So sorry, young miss, but any questions regarding the gentleman's application should be taken up with Mr. Fink directly. Does this strike you as good news? It doesn't strike me as good news. What do you think? Head to the gunsmith or scavenge supplies at the clock shop? They live to stir up trouble. So you beware the hyena. They will leave you with naught but the sound of their laughter. Fourteen! Fourteen minutes speed, now fourteen! Ten! Ten, now ten! Nine and fifty! Nine and fifty! Any lower now? Nine and ten! Nine and ten! Nine and ten! Eight and thirty! 
without this damn fool shooting up the city and blaming it all on the Fox. Though if he's amiable, yeah, yeah, he might be just the fellow we need for our immediate concerns. Scott Mabuda. Who? The founder of Buddhism. Spent 49 days under a Bodhi tree until he achieved enlightenment. Something tells me Comstock doesn't cater to idols getting worship that ain't him. Hello? Hello? Mr. Lin? Chen Lin? Is anybody here? What happened here? Someone worked this place over. Local constabulary, no doubt. Someone downstairs. Excuse me. Ma'am, I'm sorry to bother you. We're looking for Mr. Lin. Mr. Chen Lin. Mr. Lin, not here. He... gone. Gone? They take... flying squad. I pray, Gautama Buddha. Pray, give husband back. Give back to Mei Lin. Where did they take him? Club. Everyone take to good time club. Where is this club? <laughs> Ma'am, please, where, where is this club? Booker will find it. Just leave her be. Why not Vox Bully help Chen Lin? Why not Daisy Fitzroy help Chen Lin? <laughs> Cops. The kind who probably got their boot on Lin's throat asking him how well he knows Daisy Fitzroy. Isn't she the one we're working for? As a matter of fact, it is. Right, let's figure out where this good time club is.
Sense of that. It's the friend of hunger, the comrade of want, and the partner of disease. And I, for one, will be goddamned if I'm going to let an anarchist come between you and your livelihood. and find Mr. Lin, and just call me Booker. One day, ain't nobody noticed me. Then they think I done for Lady Comstock, and well, everybody noticed me. I head to Finkton, and I hide. I hide deep. The more they look, deeper I go. Only thing a color child can count on is the fact they're invisible.
Shen Lin and get the hell out of here. Now, now, all I ask is that you finish what you started to it. Wouldn't want to disappoint the other applicants. Our first candidate is a veteran of Peking. Now, what's that they say about old soldiers? <laughs> Frankly, my money's on you. He's something of an old hand at handling explosives. Only man I know who hasn't <laughs> lost a limb working with them. <laughs> Yet. Firemen! <laughs> interested in your job, Fink. Now, now, I know all about your little job for Fitzroy. But do you really want to take her offer over mine? Do you know how many people would kill to be head of Fink Security? <laughs> You're a tough nut to crack, Mr. DeWitt. A tough nut. Down. 
like Fink. Really? Yeah, and I was with the Pinkertons. They call us in when the workers got restless. To do what? Demonstrate the folly of men striking, throwing down tools. You hurt people. I'll tell you this. Sometimes there's precious need for folks like Fitzroy. Why? Because of folks like me. All yours. message from the Vox Populi. Secret codes? Cypher should be around somewhere. More money. Okay. privies down here. They treat them like animals. Is that not cruel? To forbid the mixing of the races. Is that not cruel? To give the vote to the white man and deny it to the yellow, the black, the red. Is that not cruel? But is it not cruel to banish your children from a perfect garden? Or drown your flock Sleep. under an ocean? He looks... Right. Sparing him was no mercy. If not the schoolhouse of the Lord. This one open? Seems easy enough. That look at people have done to deserve to be locked up in a place like this. Fink don't need much of a reason. No. No, he doesn't. Witness, Elizabeth? No problem. This is it, isn't it? Yep. Number nine. Got it. Do it? You're a lion. But you can't blame me for looking after my own interests, can you? Now I know Fitzroy has come calling, but I think you'll find your business with her has come to an end. <laughs> lions walk with lions, do it? Not hyenas!
late. God damn it. Nick, this is what he meant. Now we need to find someone else to make those guns. No. Dead is dead, Elizabeth. Dead is dead. What? Where the hell did... I see heads. And I see tails. It's all a matter of perspective. Why are you following us? Who sent you? Comstock? What do you want What from... do you see here, from this angle? Dead. Listen. And that angle? Alive. Walker. Chen Lin. This is becoming rather awkward. This one needs a bit of a nudge. The body's gone. It was never here. It's another Columbia. A different Columbia. The same coin. A different perspective. Heads. Tails. Dead. Alive. We have to go through to this other Columbia, but how? It's like riding a bicycle. One never really forgets. One just needs the courage to climb a pole. If we go into this tear, I don't think I'll be able to bring us back. Are you sure you're ready? Okay, open it. No blood. And no body. It's another world, Booker. Another Columbia. Something tells me one dead gunsmith ain't the only thing that's changed. Chen Lin is alive now. We're in a world where he was never murdered. Somewhere we'll find out why, I suppose. I don't suspect you can change something like that and have everything else remain the same.
we just fought. In the other world, he was the one who was strung up on the wall. In the other world? This whole business makes my head hurt. Found some money. Booker, here. That'll do. Help me out with this lock? Looks simple enough. All done. anything? Huh? No machines. No tools. Let's go find that gunsmith. Maybe he's upstairs now. Booker, look. The shrine. It's a figure of Comstock now.
Mr. Lin? Chen Lin? Excuse me, Chen Lin? Who are you? You speak up! Speak up! Can't hear you over all these machines! Very loud! I'm Booker DeWitt. Stand back! These machines very dangerous. Wait downstairs with Mrs. Lin. Uh, Daisy Fitzroy sent us. We need to talk to you about getting some weapons. Machines very dangerous. No place for stupid people. Want to lose pretty head? Mr. Lin. Downstairs! What is wrong with him? Remember him dead in that cell? Maybe in, in some way he remembers that too. How would you reconcile that? I don't know. Kill my husband? Calm his troubled thoughts. Ease his burden. Excuse me, ma'am. I'm looking for Mrs. Lin. I'm Mrs. Lin? No, I, I mean a little Chinese lady. She was... Booker, this is Mrs. Lin. They took Chen's tools. What's he got without his tools? Well, your husband is a bit out of sorts. If he could work again, maybe... If, if he could work, he'd... Mrs. Lin, can you tell me who took your husband's tools? Goddamn police! They took them and locked them up in the impound in Shantytown. Would having his tools back fix his mind? Who cares? We're not getting any guns if Chen Lin doesn't have his tools. Let's head to Shantytown. had a bloody nose. Seems to be in style. This Tara. I'm not so sure it was a good idea. You know what Daisy Fitzroy and her anarchist cronies want for you? <laughs> uh, Strap, they say. <laughs> Throw down your tools, they say. Why are you What you do? mystery to me as anyone else. Maybe Songbird knows, but he's not talking. <laughs> I'm sorry. I have to wear this stylish thimble to cover up the hideous deformity. Anger all the great secrets. Ammo, Booker! Surrender! Take this! Appreciate it!
Need money? Catch, Booker. You must think me some sort of freak. A girl who can bring dead men back to life. Whose only acquaintance is a, a giant bird creature. I must seem ridiculous. You just got dealt a bad hand. I am not going back to that tower no matter what happens. They won't stop until they have you. Why? What did I do to them? You frightened them. Good. This is what they want, brothers. To keep you so hungry, you can't speak but to me. To keep you so ignorant, you can't think of solutions to all your problems. To keep you chasing that almighty silver eagle so you can buy everything they're selling to keep you down. But Daisy Fitzroy says there's another way. Another way coming real soon. These people are like this because of Fink? Maybe Daisy's right. Maybe she should pay him back for all of this. Not before she pays us. We're here for guns and then the airship. I guess we could head straight for the police station. Or see what's in that bar. Back it up, Skell. Thief and back! Ah! Ah!
floors deep underground. Well, wish I knew how to play. I might just spell some of the gloom. I saw a fire burning. A fire's got heat of plenty, but it ain't got no mouth. Daisy. Will the circle be unbroken by and by, by and by, is a better still have. Please, help her.
Over there. That one. Now! You bet. <gasps> People are treated like men. Others like animals. There's plenty of places down below where you'll find more of the same. Like it. That wounded knee. Yeah. There's the impound. We're gonna have to get through an army to get those tools. Gunsmith, like a bug, and took his tools for our own. Make no mistake, soldiers. The box and weapons go together like fire and gunpowder. One spark, and we'll have a blaze we cannot control. Oh, 
Right up your alley. Let me see. It's done. Oh, my God. 
They argued something fierce at night, Lady Comstock and a prophet. Could never make out what it was about from my bunk, though. After the worst, I seen she ain't left for morning prayer. So I crept upstairs to check in on her. And like a fool. Now we just have to get them back to the Vox. And then we get our airship. Murderer was what they shouted when I ran out. Could you take a look at this lock? I'll give it a whirl. Done. Who are we really helping by getting guns for the Vox Populi? It's gonna help us. Daisy can make a change, can't she? Make things better for the people here. Sure. Sure as hell aren't gonna be able to carry all this back to the shop. God, we didn't think this all the way through. Another version of this room that doesn't have any tools in it. Well, if the tools aren't in there, then they must be back, back at the, at the shop. shop. Booker, if we go into this terra, I don't think there's any turning back. Are you sure you want to go now? Let's head back to the gunsmith and finish our deal. I aim to be on that airship and well shut of this place for long. Walker, if the Vox get their weapons, there's going to be a revolution just like Les Miserables. These people are gonna have better lives. Yeah. Airship will be well shut of this place.
You, you're Booker DeWitt, the hero of the Vox. What the hell are they talking about? Look at that poster. In this world, you're a hero. I remember I led the Vox. S Slate and I burned down the Hall of Heroes. Booker, the nose. Hard to think of. Two memories in the same place. Hooker, come back to me. We're going to find Daisy Fitzroy. We're getting out of here on the first lady. Let's go. Folk need a better class of hero. When it comes down to it, the only difference between Comstock and Fitzroy is how you spell it. enemies delivering a tornado blow hold and release to build up a more devastating tornado blow If I brought us to a world where the Vox had weapons, or I created one.
like I got a friend in town after all. Slate. He's fell in with these Vox Populi. And for irregulars, I will say... This is, this is not what I meant to have happen. Elizabeth. They're dead, Booker. Come on. Let's leave this place. Let's go to the factory and get our airship. I get the girl. Obliged. door open unless someone takes that airship out. Are we volunteering? Sabotage the engine and bring this thing down. Okay, 
know how to get off this thing. Daisy in the factory. The gates are open! No let's take their heads! We need to take that elevator up. Bet at least. Thanks, office. Just right for each other, aren't they? Who? That's Roy and Comstock. <laughs> May Lynn? Mr. Lynn? My god, I I was so set on getting to Paris. I, I didn't really think that You couldn't have known this would happen. I had a role in this catastrophe. If if you want to pretend that we're purely innocents in this, then that's your prerogative, but... Um, hello? Fink? I saw you die, Booker. Saw it with my own eyes. Fitzroy. Listen, I got you your guns. I'm here for my airship. But my Booker DeWitt died for the Vox Populi. You either an imposter or a ghost. My Booker DeWitt was a hero to the cause, a story to tell your children. You, you just complicate the narrative. Do 
Wash away your enemies. Hold to grab enemies and release to reel them in for punishment. Perhaps though, Comstock will have some need of this kind of thing to keep watch in that tower he is building. You hold on to this. Some help with this. I'll see what I can do. There you go. Hooker! No! 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 no. Every step is 
It? Is this your movement, Daisy? This is what needs to be done. You see, the founders ain't nothing but weeds. Cut them down and they just grow back. If you want to get rid of the weed, you got to pull it up from the root. It's the only way to get rid of Elizabeth. I guess it runs in the family. Uh, Elizabeth. Whoa, whoa, hey, hey, easy. Elizabeth. This is all I had. Listen. How do you do it? How do I do what? Forget. How do you wash away the things that you've done? You don't. You just learn to live with it. So the moment of truth between us. New York or Paris? Gotta find a way to make this thing go faster. It's got to be some sort of, some sort of throttle or accelerator. Do you know something. what that looks like? I don't know. Help me find it. That's not it. Certainly is. Is it? Is. 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 Try again. All right. Hold on. Here you are. Booker! We've got to stop them! 
No, that's the E. No, oh, that is her. certainly it. No, it's not. It is. Isn't. Is. Isn't. Is. Play the whole song, try he'll come again. back. No, you try. Fine. Hurry, Booker, hurry! 